want to get Marco's new rig in the shed so he can start working on it. It's only got three bays, so the G60 body was taken up one, sitting on blocks. The GQ chassis was taken up one in the middle, and then the GU the patrol, which I still needed some work on, was sitting in the third bay. So we're gonna, well, we have hoisted this up. Bit of a dodgy setup, but we got it there. Um, that's why I put them up there initially, just for this project. So we're gonna just sit the G60 onto the onto the GQ just to gain a base so Marco can bring his new bus in and start pulling that thing apart. Are we happy with that? What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Now, plans with the Defender. Probably gonna leave it stock, uh, just because it's... Nah, not gonna leave it stock, how boring. Start at the front, no idea what I'm gonna do with the front bar. I do like the front end of these things, so I don't wanna just put a ARB bar on the front of it, so I'm not sure what I'm gonna do there. Now, engine, now it's a 300 TDI, so, Bit of a slug, no doubt. Um, but they're still, you can still tweak them up just a tiny bit, um, trying to still keep them as reliable as possible. Um, so there'll be a small amount of engine work, um, nothing too drastic. Right, wheels and tires. Um, these little cute ones are gonna have to go. I'm thinking 35s. I'm not sure if that's exactly easy on these things or not, but Nick's got them, I've got to get them. Probably just steel rims. I'm not even sure if there's many options as far as alloys go, but yeah, steel rims. So yeah, 35s, probably have to throw some new guards on to cover them. We'll wait and see what the offset is exactly. Uh, all right, as for rear bar, again, not too sure. Um, Are you sure about anything? <laughs> No, uh, yeah, uh, this is the rear bar right here, so I'm not sure what I'm gonna do here. Um, as you can see, I've already taken the tire off the door because that's just a nightmare um, and a problem waiting to happen. So that's pretty much a spare tire hanging off sheet metal. It's ridiculous, so that's already off. Um, so I'm definitely going to need a tie carrier, so something that swings away with the door um, but just takes the weight off the door and puts it on a hinge. Um, I know there's plenty of options there. Something I need to find out um, sooner rather than later. Well, under here... If we're going to put 35s on it, um, probably going to have to strengthen a few bits and pieces under here. There is no lockers at the moment. You can get center, front and rear locker in these things. It does already have heavy duty flanges. So that's one thing. And actually I think it has heavy duty axles on the rear maybe. Have to confirm that. Anyway, I'll go heavy duty axles front and rear. I'll probably have to put heavy duty CVs up front as well. Again, probably pretty early on before we take this thing too far off-road. Um, brakes, just looking at them now, are pitted and looking really shit. So there'll be new brakes all round. Uh, what else? Fuel tank. Put a Long Ranger in there. That is for sure. Interior. There's a lot of it. Oh. So as you can see, I have just started throwing a bit of uh, insulation on the roof. So it's sound one at sound, uh, sound Deadner stage one from car builders. Also have um, a six mil 
stage two to go on the roof as well, and then every other surface to cover as well. Um, the back seats are out at the moment just to get that job done. Uh, well, these seats are not too bad for sitting your bum down temporarily, but these things will have to go. Um, and they are actually going to go soon too. Um, I don't really want to go too far in these things. Leg room is maybe just acceptable. Uh, we're going to have to do something up the front here too. There's not a lot going on. I do have a CD player, so that's cool. Um, next is probably electrical. So yes, electrical. Um, so starting with the battery, battery, I have a lithium battery to go in. Uh, I have a thousand watt inverter to go in. I'm also going to need a Red Arc battery manager of some sort. So I'm thinking about doing it properly and just going for the manager 30. Um, and I would love the Red Vision display as well, but we'll see what happens there. Um, we've just got a few good ideas in the works with that. Um, but yeah, potentially something down the side here or either side for inverter, isolator, whatever it might be. And storage as well. Um, pretty uh, important part of these things too. When you're traveling long distances and trying to store probably too much shit on the road, um, you've got to make sure it's correct. So I might continue to leave it as a two-seater uh, up in the air. Don't know yet. Um, but after seeing Nick's uh, draw system that he's put in there recently, I'm going to go with a similar unit that's made for these. So it'll be one big drawer and actually leaves the top um, pretty much flat then, a flat surface. Um, other things, storage, gull wings. Love them, always wanted gull wings. So that is basically picture a canopy door on the side of your wagon. Amazing, great access for the back, both sides. Ugh. Roof rack, uh, definitely going to go to front runner roof rack, probably the first mod I did when I first got a Jeep, so already purchased a roof rack for this thing, um, and the good thing about that is most of the accessories that I have, I can continue to run on this thing, so yeah, not even a decision there, roof rack is uh, a must, and front runner, only way to go. What else? Uh, lighting. So yeah, finally, with lighting, I've got the same Baja Designs uh, roof rack mounted light bar to go up the top. Not sure how that's gonna sit. We'll wait and see, but it may have to move them down a bit. Don't know yet. Um, so stay tuned. Those are the plans. Some are already underway, as you can see. I've got only probably six weeks to do this because we want to head over on a what couple weeks nick well i think it's going to be about four four week trip three or four three weeks oh, cool the longer the better so it's shaped down is going to be a three week three or four week trip heading into state hopefully um so yeah we've got to get moving stay tuned they'll be coming up very soon thanks for watching